to another Trails from the Dark Side reviews. Uh, if you've seen these before, you'll know that it's just me giving my average rider opinion on equipment and gear that I use on a weekly basis. Hopefully it'll help some people out. Uh, I know when I buy stuff or I'm thinking about buying anything, I always like to look at things on YouTube. It's, it's, it's just nice to see it uh, from a normal point of view. So, this time we have the Fox Racing Impact Pro Frame Softback. Uh, as always, by Fox, they do love their big names. But this is what they call a roost protector, or for normal people, a chest protector. And this is what I'm wearing pretty much every time we go out now. And I just thought I'd give you my opinions on it. As you can see, it's pretty low profile. Uh, the D3O on the back, which I find is a lot better uh, than having a, a harder thing on the back, uh, especially if you're wearing a rucksack. It gives you a lot more manoeuvrability. Uh, when it heats up, it becomes super pliable. I mean, it's not too bad at the moment, as you can see, but when it heats up, it it's great. It's just, I mean, you don't literally don't feel that you've got it on. I'm um, sure it fits. There we go, as you can see, you've got full range of movement, which is great. The back coverage doesn't give you full back coverage. Obviously there's still a, a bit, but it does protect obviously the, the main part of your ribs and the, the top of your back, which is great. It's articulated here, which means it folds in nice around the chest. Uh, and obviously nice plastic on the front, it's got Fox's proprietary armour underneath that can be removed, uh, although I don't know why you would buy this and remove the armour from the chest. Obviously the back part doesn't come up. Uh, you may have seen on the channel, uh, I think it was last year, I reviewed the Troy Lee uh, protective shirt that I was wearing when I was trail riding. It's been a great shirt, uh, but I find now that I'm moving on to the more technical stuff, the more enduro stuff, uh, I found it was quite restrictive on movement, for, especially when you start throwing the bike about. So I needed something that was a bit more lightweight, but being middle age, you don't bounce as well as you used to. Uh, so I'm always worried about getting something that puts you off work. I mean, that's really what it comes down to at the end of the day. If, if you can't work, you can't buy bike stuff. So priorities are first. Hence the reason I went for this. Fox make great stuff. Probably one of my favourite brands. Uh, I know you pay for the name a lot of the time, but they do make really good stuff. And this ticks all the boxes for me. It's lightweight. It fits well. Plenty of manoeuvrability. And it, it gives you decent protection, which is the main thing. I mean, that's really why you're buying it. So all in all, fantastic piece of kit. I would highly recommend to anyone that's, that's just looking for something that's not too obtrusive, uh, but hopefully in a jam will we'll, we'll get you out of it. So there you go, there's my, my two cents on the, the, the Fox Impact Pro Frame, blah, 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 blah. Uh, it's a, a great piece of kit, I would highly recommend. So thanks for watching, uh, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, uh, it really helps me out. and. Uh, until next time, ride safe, keep the faith.